Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. This will be a quick video in return for that. There's a patch 12.5b coming out, right? It's taking a break, of course. They're doing like a mid patch, like a micro patch in between, though. Pro play playoffs are coming up and stuff like that. And so they want to kind of reel in some stuff. This is going to cover the entirety of the patch, which is actually really short nonetheless. So let's just jump into it. Hey, hey. One hey would have been good enough. No Chiaki here. Hey, hey. It's 12.5B preview time. 12.5B is the scheduled micro patch we're putting out Wednesday to do some balance adjustments before the longer break. We'll also be swapping the patch preview around between me and a few other people on the team starting the next few patches. So here's the champions that are getting buffed in the coming patch. Master Yi, Varys, Draven, Ash, Lucian. So for a while now, especially in pro play, if you're not watching, a lot of AD carries just aren't picked. And so one of the things people have been saying is instead of nerfing the top AD carries, because then maybe no AD carries get picked and we're back to 811, why not just start buffing some other AD carries and maybe even in ways that make them more viable, not just purely on power, but like, hey, we want a Lucian comp. We want an Ash comp. We want a Draven comp. I don't know. I think only a few people play Draven really well in pro play anyways, uh, with that being said, right? So it looks like that's what they're going to do is buff. They're buffing like four AD carries and Master Yi, funnel strat coming back maybe, I don't know, hopefully not, uh, but champion nerfs meanwhile, nerfing Rise, nerfing Zeri, nerfing Jinx, and nerfing Aphelios, so speaking of that AD carry problem pro play, Aphelios and Jinx have kind of been the main two go-to AD carries, and I'm going to talk about this more in the Let's Talk Jinx episode, but it's just like, part of Jinx's success is that she just dunks on Aphelios, and teams in pro play still keep picking Aphelios into the Jinx, after Jinx has already been picked, they're like, we're still going to Aphelios, and like, at that point, you just you're just signing up to lose. It's just that's how that works. Aphelios is just not better than Jinx right now, uh, so you, this is kind of like an auto win for the Jinx. It kind of inflates her win rate a bit, but I get it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, with that being said, however, um, it is going to be interesting to see what exactly these changes will be. This is just confirming who is and who is not getting buffed and nerfed. It doesn't actually say specifically what they are. We do know the Jinx one, thanks to Spider-X over. Spider-X30 on his Twitter has been putting out some of the specific tooltips from the PvE and what they are. Also, Locket of the Iron Solari is getting nerfed as well. I don't know if that's a pro play one or uh, just across the board one. But these are basically just basically eight champions, nine champions if you include Master Yi. Uh, if you take out Rise and Master Yi, though, it's like it's all 80 carries either getting buffed or nerfed. So the 80 carry meta might be shifting in the coming days just in time for the pro play pay playoffs, if I can speak. And also MSI. MSI will be coming up in May when it's the uh, playoffs in because the playoffs will be played on one patch specifically. And then MSI probably on the following patch. And so we'll see how things land. So... Uh, uh, with that being said, that's all for this video. I said it'd be quick, so thank you so much for watching this video. Again, do make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Thank you so much. But I don't know which video will be next, because life can have a lot of kinks. So until next time, take care. GG get jinxed. Thank you for watching. And enjoy pizza responsibly. The